So today I'm posting a question and I've got an issue uh, with the shower. It's in an older home uh, that I'm working on. And it's got these mixing valves, if you will. And I've actually replaced all of the stems and the seats in the valves. And what I was attempting to do is to get it to where when you turn the center knob to divert the water from the tub to the shower that it works properly. And, but I'll show you here what I've got going on. And I've gotten several, you can see that I've got the water running in the tub, it's cold water right now. And I'm gonna aim the shower head over to the side there because I don't wanna take a bath yet, even though I may need one. All right, now I'm gonna turn on the diverter knob and I've got it turned all the way. You can see the shower head here. It's actually putting out a very limited amount of water. But I've also still got a pretty good amount of water coming out of the faucet at the tub. Turn this off now. And again, I've, I've replaced the stems. These are brand new stems and brand new seats all the way across here. And I've talked to some people and been looking on the internet for some advice. And one suggestion was that there's actually the inside of the wall here in this valve. We'll try that again. The inside of this wall here, I've got the valve and I'll show you that it's, it's fairly accessible. You can see here, there's the valves, the wall, and the shower. There's even an access panel in this wall to get into the drain that I've actually been into recently, replacing the, the stopper. But it was suggested by one local plumbing supply company that I may actually have a cracked valve or in other words, the, the unit that's up inside the wall here may have a small hairline crack and it's not letting the water divert properly from the tub up to the shower head when this is turned, which I don't know, may be the case. It just, it seems odd to me. So I, anyway, I guess what I'm asking is, is there any way to test for this or is what I'm seeing uh, the end result of, of having a problem or you know what needs to happen before I tear into this wall and completely try to you know replace that or just blindly call a plumber out to the location without knowing for sure if it's something I could easily fix I kind of like uh, some you know thoughts or opinions from some of you experts out there uh, that might be willing to share you know some advice <laughs> I don't know if there's uh, some sort of an adjustment in here on these stems that would be causing this or if I've actually got a problem and I did I actually replaced the stems twice thinking maybe that I had gotten the wrong stem or something and and I checked all of that and made sure that I was going back with the exact same make and model if you will same brand that was in there uh, when I pulled the old ones out. In fact, I've still got the old ones. I just, uh, I've not gotten rid of them yet because I'm kind of kind of fishing around to see what's going on. But anyway, that's my problem. And uh, if anybody has some advice or an opinion, I would appreciate some feedback. Thanks.